Hey, Hickok 45 here, sitting out here in the field in the chair like I always do, right? Actually, we've not done a, a V-log, and I love to call it a V-log to upset people, but we've not done one for almost a year, I think. I think it might be because I gab so much at you on the radio show, you know, and I don't know. But we need to do one of these every now and then. I, I kind of miss sitting somewhere where I normally wouldn't be sitting in my uh, easy chair, uh, you know, talking to the trees and John, the camera. So hopefully somebody's listening besides John and the camera and the birds and the worms. But anyway, uh, I digress. Uh, haven't chatted with you like this in live and in person uh, about something other than firearms for a while, so I wanted to, to do that. And uh, first and foremost is to thank everybody for tuning in because we uh, turned 800,000 subscribers recently and uh, you know another milestone and uh, just another demonstration of the fact that there are so many people who have absolutely no taste whatsoever, right? Aha, uh -huh. funny, funny. No, we appreciate you all and you know that and I hope you do. Uh, it may not be everybody's cup of tea, right? Uh, but there are a lot of people that seem to want to tune in and man, we appreciate it. Uh, we do a lot of strange things, I guess, at times. We, uh, uh, a variety of things. You know, who else is going to do a radio show that's not on the radio? You know, just weird things like that. and Strange FAQs and, uh, you know, videos on such a variety of things, uh, including but not exclusively to watermelon killing and pumpkin killing and <laughs> things of that nature. But anyway, hopefully most of what we do is of some educational value to you uh, with a little entertainment thrown in and fun because I like to have fun. Got to be safe first and foremost, but I like to have fun too. So anyway, we appreciate you all tuning in and uh, watching the videos. Uh, they're, you know, it's, uh, it's amazing the, the numbers of you that are out there at your computer screen or your your TV, your smart TV, you know, like John has. John has a smart TV. I have a dumb TV. And it's really uh, interesting to go to his house and watch uh, YouTube videos on the TV. <laughs> it's like you go from, I don't know, uh, what, what's that? Uh, no, I can't think of the movie uh, service, but there's all kinds of things. You're, you're going from Justified or uh, the news to a YouTube video. It's, it's really interesting how the world's changing and, uh, you know, where these crazy videos are actually available and where you're looking at them on. You're looking at them on your, uh, your little pocket phone, right? Uh, we know that for a fact. And speaking of that, I forgot to turn mine down. I'd hate to get a call from Cindy Crawford right in the middle of a vlog because I would have to take that call, right? Uh, you know, I mean, she's been stalking me, so I've got to talk to her. But anyway, we appreciate you all. And, uh, you know, just thought I'd touch base a little bit here in person live make you look at my face unlike the radio shows where i hang out in the reloading room and just uh chat about a couple of things first of all is that not beautiful that's that henry that most of you should be aware of oh i found and i am so happy to have found it okay we'll put him on half cock because we're going to shoot him in a little bit maybe if you behave and you watch carefully uh beautiful beautiful firearm hope you caught that video by the way the winchester lever guns rifle video that we posted recently had a lot of fun with that oh man those those rifles it was really difficult to take them off the table you know when that video was over it's just okay take them away let's take them away and start cleaning them up and you know return the the borrowed ones and clean the other ones and uh, tuck them away safely very difficult but uh it was fun making that and it was, I, one of the really cool, cool parts was actually getting them out and laying them on the table and just spacing them there and then just, wow, you know, uh, as, as much as shooting them really, just seeing them all there together. Virtually every Winchester that came along, you know, during the 1800s basically, you know, with just a couple of exceptions of a prototype or two, they were there, all the popular Winchesters, so, or remakes of them. Uh, and as I talked about, you know, the replicas like this firearm, they're really cool. Uh, yeah, I guess there's nothing like having an original, and I have some originals, but you know, these, these are very, very cool because they're made almost exactly like the originals. So you know what it was like you know, if you were living in 1880 or 1890, 1873, you know, what somebody was carrying and how it operated, the same feel, weight, 
and everything. Maybe the caliber is a little different in some cases, but cool. Anyway, I hope you saw that. I know you did if you're watching. If you're watching me sit in a chair and talk to you, surely you're watching the shooting videos. If not, you're sick. You're sicker than I am, right? So what else is going on that you're dying to hear about? Uh, a couple of things just on the channel. You know, we've, we've had a little bit of an imposter issue over the years. You know, I had one recently and I had to have a YouTube channel taken down. Just be aware if uh, you know, somebody else is taken down. Uh, be aware if you ever see a comment, and I've mentioned this before a couple places, if you ever see anything that is supposedly from me, you know, uh, and it doesn't sound like me, doesn't sound like something I would write, you know, it's probably not me, right? Man, I'm kind of an idiot, but I'm not stupid enough to make obscene or crazy, you know, remarks or insult people, you know, I'm, you know, so anyway, just be aware of that with those well you, uh, and I hope you have been tuning in to Facebook. Many of you have. I am pretty uh, religiously uh, working on that for the last two or three weeks. I have uh, kind of got that sorted out and I'm posting pictures regularly. I'm making sure the videos are posted over there, trying to, uh, Trying to go back every now and then, and, and I don't know if we'll call it the uh, underviewed video of the week or whatever, but uh, whenever I get the notion to do it, uh, we may post a video just a reminder that, hey, there's a video on this, and you know, there's 30,000 views <laughs> you know, or something was done four years ago or three years ago. It has some useful information. Uh, the reason I do that, we're not in a big marketing mode or anything, but I'll get questions every day, lots of them. It'll be things that are in videos and uh, sometimes recent videos, but oftentimes I think, oh man, this guy's new. We did a really good video on that in 2010 or 2009, you know, that, that he would love, you know. But uh, anyway, there, there's a lot of information in the backlog. And I know 800 and whatever it is, 50 videos, tough to get around to, right? But it's your duty. If you're committed, you've got to get back and watch all those videos, okay? That's where, I mean, that's what we do. The videos are the thing. Uh, this is extra. The radio show is kind of extra thing we do. And I try to answer as many questions as I can, especially if they're in a private message. And I'll answer random questions on videos and, you know, in the postings, comments, and, and things here and there as I have time or inclination. I, no way I can get to even 10% of it, probably, uh, except in the private messages. I, I answer most of those. Uh, it's in the videos, you know, the all the idiocy, all the genius, whatever it is, the brilliance, <laughs> the, the humor, the seriousness, the education, the entertainment, whatever you see, it, it's in the videos. And uh, basically is why we started doing them, to help provide some information, you know, along with some entertainment. And so that's where it is first and foremost. So try to get through the videos if you can. Look through them, uh, look for them. Again, as I post, I think, on the home page, before you ask questions, you know, look through the, uh, the FAQ videos, and uh, there's a lot of those, so, and more to come. And, and you know, they're very brief, and they, uh, whatever the topic is, it's not like it's going to be, okay, yeah, I saw those FAQ videos, you got about 50 of them or something, I can't watch 50 25-minute videos, and, well, they're, they're like a minute long, most of them, so they really are, we just did that instead of, uh, you know, pasting a boring page and text of FAQs. You know, we all hate to read those. <laughs> you know, we guys are, it's like reading the instruction manual. And so we, we put them in uh, kind of a semi-humorous video format, uh, most of them. I don't know how humorous they are, but you know how we are. Crazy. So anyway, uh, what else? Uh, yeah, Facebook, and of course that goes to Twitter. So hopefully you're following on Twitter and, and Facebook both, or you're, now I really want to make sure you either, as I, post it somewhere make sure when you go to Facebook you you hate us on Facebook right just kidding no. either like love or hate I would say uh, what else uh, what was I going to talk about the playlist yeah back to the playlist now the playlist I'm still delinquent I I, I deserve a beating because I don't have everything in the playlist I think I mentioned on a radio show how I I started putting things in there at the beginning of the summer and then I realized some of the things I'd put in weren't in there and YouTube was going through one of their periodic changes or something. So, whoa, let them get their act straight and then I'll go into that project again. Well, I need to get at it. And hopefully things will stick once I put it in a playlist. And uh, I mean, really, uh, probably 400 of the videos are not in a playlist. So if you're relatively new and don't know that, 
uh, don't go to the playlist thinking everything called lever guns is there, or everything having to do with lever guns, or having to do with 1911s, or even Glocks, or FAQs, even some of those. I'm better about the radio shows, I think, and FAQs and vlogs, maybe getting those into the playlist, but you know, it's not there. It's not there. I'll get it there. But see, a, a lot of people don't use the playlist, obviously. They, they're searching for things. They go to the channel and search for 1911s or whatever they are, you know, and, and pop in that way, or they're somewhere else on Google searching for Henry Rifle, you know, and, and it pops up. So they, they get you get to our videos a lot of different ways, I realize. But some people I know do use playlists a lot, and please know it's not all there. So. For example, you're looking for uh, what's dumb old Hickok got on uh, 22 rimfire, let's say. Well, I think I have a playlist for that. Just know that when you go there and look at all those, there's probably some others. So just go back to the home page and search in the little search bar for 22 rimfire. That'll get you there, okay? And I'll, I'll eventually get them in there, okay? I promise it'll just take a little time. It will. What are we doing? What's new? Anything new? Oh, yeah. We'll be posting uh, probably really soon uh, the little video or the video on the little gun, the the Sky, uh, what's it, the CX CPX2, something like that. Uh, had that gun for I think I talked about it in the radio show maybe. Uh, had that gun for ah seems like a couple of months, and have been firing it periodically. And uh, I go over that in the video. We fired it I think like 560 times. I don't know something 500 plus before the video and then in the video and we're going to shoot it some more before we do another chapter two with it but uh, I don't know I, co I cover pretty much in the video but I know that's a firearm I've been getting a lot of questions about because it's relatively inexpensive uh, 300 and less uh, and it feels like quality and the company that's making it seems to be really trying to make a quality firearm in that size and in that price category and uh, from all, from all I can tell, they really are trying hard to make that a, uh, a quality piece for the money. Uh, so, and a lot of you had requested that I try to get one. So I just went and bought one one Saturday and started shooting it. So give you the results in there. Uh, kind of mixed results, uh, but it's moving towards the positive, it looks like. Uh, so we'll continue with it and uh, check, out, check out the video. You might learn something. Then again, you might not, right? You never know. Kind of dangerous if you're learning anything from me, right? <laughs> uh, what else? Oh, you might be able to see behind us. Oh, you know, I'm sitting here with all my friends. These are the, uh, by the way, these are the, uh, I don't know, if, I guess we've shown you these. Everyone here I can get a hold of a little bit easier. Actually, they're all kind of hard. These are the Chapter 2 targets we use with some of the rifles. You know, and they are, you see how they're chewed up and see how thick those are? I've talked about that. I think they're a full inch thick. Uh, they're just normal steel. That's why we don't shoot these very close. We're, you know, 90 to 100 yards away. But that's why when you see me hit one of these and it doesn't fall over, that's why it doesn't fall over, okay? Actually, I never miss them. See, I hit them every time. That's <laughs> so if they don't fall, it's just because they're so thick and heavy. Uh, actually, I do miss them, but, uh, but that's what makes it. See, that, that, takes a, that takes a heck of a lick uh, if it's not set right to actually knock that thing over. That's one of the bigger ones, but that's that's what we shoot at over here. And anyway, we are uh, our wall fell down over there, came tumbling down, and we are what you're seeing there, right behind the the disc, is actually what we we're building. We moved it down closer. All right, so we're working on that. John and I've been heaving uh, the railroad ties there, stacking them. Uh, you know, the, I, he was about I forgot what we figured about 12 years old when we built the first one. It was really tough because we were out there lifting those things up. Some of them up pretty high. If you've ever lifted a railroad tie, it was all he could do to lift one in, you know, up, up as high as we needed to get. So it was that was fun. So it sort of takes us back, you know, to uh, to the day when we did that. Now that we're rebuilding it, but uh, and it's funny. I get a lot of questions about that. I've had people comment. You may have seen the postings about that wall back there because from. 200 yards it looks like a, a barn or a house or something <laughs> and i had several people you might have seen comment on that well you're shooting over there at that those targets there's a house right there behind it you know <laughs> it's actually a wall of railroad ties and we're just moving it it came tumbling down in the wind and the storm and we're going to do a better job on this one uh, but anyway that's what you're seeing behind me 
And uh, I can't think of anything else really. That was rude driving by while I was talking. I uh, can't think of anything else really that uh, you're dying to hear about. Uh, I could make up something, but I'm not going to do it right now. But we, again, we're just uh, uh, appreciative of you all stopping in and, and your commitment really to, there's kind of a commitment to, to watch the videos. You know, we get right down to it because as <laughs> the venue, YouTube changes things around as they're doing right now as I speak, you know, with the Google Plus and everything, I know some people are, what is this? I haven't figured it out either. But, uh, you know, looking on the bright side, you know, where else could we make videos and just post them, you know, and, uh, and then easily searchable and everything, and there they are, essentially free, you know, to you all to just come and watch, you know. So, you know, it, for all of its warts, you know, and the negative side to, uh, to it, it's, yeah, it's still a pretty good system. So hopefully we can get through the changes and the, the evolution of uh, wherever they're going with it and uh, whatever it turns out to be. Maybe it'll turn out to be better you know, before they're finished. I don't know. But anyway, we, we appreciate you, you know, struggling through to get to the videos and then coming back and then you know, subscribing so that you're notified and you know when we post it and going to Facebook and Twitter and you know, keeping up with us because we're going to keep doing it. Uh, we'll be here. We'll be making videos. You know, it doesn't matter where they are. We will, we will have videos where you can get to them now, tomorrow, 10 years from now. That's, that's our plan, you know, wherever that is. It's in the cloud. It's on YouTube. <laughs> it's on a big screen here in, in the field. I don't know. We'll, we'll put them out where you can see them, okay? Uh, so we enjoy doing it still, and, uh, and I hope and know that you enjoy watching them or else you wouldn't be here watching me ramble right and you know what this gun is loaded that's why it's pointed down range so i'm going to take a couple of shots hope you don't mind the 1860 henry oh man i love it i'll see you right there there's a little bit of steel over there that's far enough away from john and everything we can <laughs> Big old 45 Colt brass case. Do I have to tell you, life is really good.